Hello, my marvelous muses. How we doing tonight, guys? So, I got them all here. We haven't tried yet. And that is our little honey pot mold. So, I was going to do it in that color that I did the uh, people, that mom holding the kid in. I was going to do it in that color. But, I want to do something different. I'm going to play around. I've got this beautiful chameleon powder here. It is a uh, golden, golden green and yellow, and I thought about putting that in it, and then I've got this yellow iridescent glitter here. I thought about putting maybe some of that in with it, and I was going to try to color this with my alcohol marker, I mean my uh, acrylic pen, but one of the subscribers had recommend trying an alcohol marker instead. Well, I've got my alcohol markers here, and I thought, why not try it? See what happens. And uh, so we're going to see what we can do here. I've got a yellow here for my bee. And I've actually got a bigger color variety here. I've got gray so I can do a gray in his wings instead of black. Let's see if this works. Hmm. I don't know that it's doing a whole lot more. Maybe. Maybe what we need to do is let it... I'll do a little bit here. I'll do a little bit right here. And, uh... Them. Now we're going to get into the black and white. I mean, black and yellow here. Not a whole lot, huh? Not doing much. Not doing much. I might have to do it after the fact. If I do it after the fact, I'm going to use my acrylic markers. Yeah, I don't think he's going to color in. Especially this yellow. This yellow stuff ain't. Yeah, we're going to have to do him after the fact, guys. Have to do him after the fact. Okay. Yeah, we're going to do them after. Alright, so I'm going to put you guys on a pause. I'm going to mix up some resin here, and we'll be right back. Alright, guys, we're back. So I got my resin mixed up here. And like I said, I'm going to put some chameleon powder in it. And we're going to put some glitter. Be a lot. <laughs> Actually, no, I got eight ounces of resin mixed up here, so probably not a lot in it. Let's get this stirred in really good. If you look at the container, it's about empty. It is about empty. Probably one of my favorite colors of the chameleon powders. Oh, I love it. Yeah, 
I thought this color looks like honey too, so that's why we're doing a honey pot. So guys, if you haven't entered the contest, a lot of people entered, guys. A lot of people are entering, and I appreciate that. $100 giveaway. Amazon, Timu, whatever, your choice. If you want a McDonald's, $100 McDonald's gift card, I don't care. Um, and I'm going to have the drawing next week. Uh, we're going to have the contest up going for a week. If you like, subscribe. And type in marvelous giveaway so um, I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna do a random comment picker thing and it will go in and anybody that has commented or picked out those, those words out anybody that's commented is gonna pick between those people so you have to comment that and I appreciate it. so all the nice comments guys everybody I just love reading the comments I really do I learned so much from you guys, and it's just, it's great. It's such a wonderful community of people. Very blessed to have such a great viewing, a great viewership of people. I appreciate all of you guys. I appreciate everybody for watching. If you bought me a coffee, if you bought me a super thanks, I appreciate that as well, guys. If you ever want to send me something, let me know. If you ever want to purchase something, my email's in the description box. I saw where one of the girls had a Poshmark store for her stuff, and I thought about, I don't know, I'm going to check into that. I had Etsy for a while, and it just, Etsy sucked. It really did. It was just like, I didn't do it very well on there. And they charged you a fee every month, whether you sold anything or not. Granted, the fee wasn't huge, but it was still, if you had a lot on there, it ended up being quite a bit. We're filling this mold all the way up here. Oops. Don't go over, don't go over, don't go over. It's so close. And I can see a bubble right here. I can see a bubble right there. Let me get a... Grab a micro brush here. Grab a little micro brush here. See if we can't get that bubble out. You see it right here, guys? You probably can't see it. Right there. Come on. Okay, so we have a two here board. Kind of looking to make sure every look, everything looks like it's covered and good. I feel like this could use just a tiny bit more. There we go. And I have a little bit left. I want to pour it in. And here we go. You can see we got the tray here. Let me just pour this in here. Maybe I'll go in on the front of this. That's pretty. Uh, maybe we'll go in on the front of this after the fact and add on some of the stickers, the washi tape stickers or something. Some of that beautiful washi tape. We'll use some more of that. How's that, guys? On the front of here.
perfect. Alright guys. You let this cure and we'll be back tomorrow night. See you then. Hello my friends. We're back guys. Yay. How are we doing? Hope everybody's having a good night. We are demolding day. We love demolding day, right? We love demolding time. I gotta move this out of the way. I gotta show you this. I made this for my friend's mother. It is her birthday this weekend. And she buys lottery tickets. And last year I made her one. And it's like a pouch to stick her lottery tickets down in. And then she can use it over and over again to keep, keep them from week to week or whatever. And, uh, yeah, so I made it, and then I'm going to give her a necklace. I was going to give her something for her house, but she told her daughter she had to make a necklace already. She wanted me to make her a new folder, because the one I made her last year is kind of getting a little rough. So I made her a new folder. It's pretty fun. I got that, um, I got this poster board at Walmart. favorite. Look at this poster board. It has gold and blue and red and green and this holographic. And I was like, this stuff is just beautiful. So, I had to show you guys that before we demold here. Uh, so, how's your day been, guys? Hope everybody had a good day. I got the stuff to get my roof fixed. But we were gonna do it today, but uh, it rained again, so they don't want to. He didn't want to do it, and it's got to set up for at least 24 hours, so he didn't want to do it, and it rained. It's supposed to rain Sunday, so not sure if we're gonna get it done tomorrow or not. But at least I have the stuff to do it with now. Uh, also, guys, just so you know, uh, somebody had recommended this, so I went ahead and did it. Uh, I have an Amazon wish list now. It'll be linked in the description box. Uh, got a variety of different items. Some are just things that I'm saving up for or want to get. Uh, I use the fetch rewards. And uh, I'm trying to save up enough because I want to get one of the Let's Resin Curie Machines. That's one of the things on my wish list. Um, but there's also just like small items, glitter, pigment paste, stuff like that. Uh, so if you ever want to check that out. Feel free to. Also, I have a link for my PayPal. If you ever want to buy me a coffee, I've had several wonderful people buy me a coffee this month. Oh, look at this, guys. Isn't this pretty? Bring it up here so you can see it a little bit better. This is beautiful. Oh, I love that color shift. Oh, wow. You can see the yellow sparkle in it, the glitter. Let me find my other paper here. Like I said, I've had a couple people tell me they can't really see what I'm doing. So let me grab my other sheet here. I'm going to put it underneath here so you can see better. What did I do with it? <laughs> how do I lose it? It's huge. <laughs> I don't understand how I lost it. Hang on, guys. I'll be right back. Let me grab it. I want you guys to be able to see this better. Oh, here it is. It fell off the back. Let's go. You're like, how did I lose it already? How did I lose it? I didn't. It just fell off the back end of where I had it. All right, let's see if this helps. Let's see if this helps any. So you guys can see better. There we go. Does that help, guys? I hope so. Get my light here situated maybe a little better. Beautiful. I love it. All right, let's see what we got here. All right. Oh, 
that's pretty. Oh my gosh. Look at the bee. Isn't he pretty, guys? Oh my gosh, she's beautiful. So, I kind of think I want to color him in. Yeah, I kind of think I want to color him in. So, for this, I'm going to use my acrylic pens, my acrylic markers here. Get my yellow out. And my black. Maybe a gray. I think we'll do his wings in gray. We were going to do them earlier in gray. And it didn't work out very good. I tried doing the alcohol. And I think when she told me that, I think she meant the uh, for me to try that on the embossing folders. So, because I tried it on the mold and it didn't work on the mold. And some molds you can't, won't take either one really. They won't take the, they won't take these markers even. So, um... Let me get this up here where you guys can see. Hang on, let me turn the slide on. See if this helps here. Basically, I'm just going to color this in on his wings. And it's just coloring the braised areas, is what it's doing. That's pretty. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. All right. Okay. Now let's do the yellow. Okay. Got that part covered this little piece here and let's do this little bitty piece right here all right now we're gonna bring the black in and we're gonna do black stripe right there There. His little black head. His little legs. And then his little antenna here. All right, dear little bee, isn't he pretty? And then we put our little box together here. Turned out beautiful. All right, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put you guys on a hold. I'm gonna bring you down here and let you check it out. And we'll see how she looks. Okay guys, we'll be right back. Okay guys, here we go. Again, here's our little bee. He's sparkly, isn't he? And then this is the little box all put together. What do you think, guys? How'd we do? I think it turned out gorgeous. I love this. Wow. I've been doing pretty good, guys, getting the glitter not to sink. Not using too much. But yet, still sparkles like diamonds. I love it. Alright, guys. I hope everybody has a wonderful night. I hope you're happy, healthy, safe, and blessed. Hope your resin cures beautifully. Your craft projects turn out amazing. And I'll see you guys tomorrow night. Bye.